The following contest is a fatal four-way tag team match and is for the World Tag Team Championship. Introducing first, at a combined weight of 464 pounds, Matt Harvey and Jeff Hardy, the Hardy Boys. This is a big-time opportunity, Byron, as the title will be on the line here. You're right, Michael, and judging from the response on social media heading into this match, we're likely to see a new champ crowned here tonight. And their opponents first at a combined weight of 557 pounds. Chaos! Remember, guys, the title is on the line here in this one. And I don't remember the last time the champ was in this much. And here they come. Making their way to the ring at a combined weight of 585 pounds. And their opponents at a combined weight of 455 pounds. They are the World Tag Team Champions, the Tough Guys. The champ comes into his title defense incredibly competent, Corey. And with good reason, Cole. When you're the champ, you don't have to worry about winning. You just have to make sure you don't lose. That is the champion's advantage. Tornado tag with multiple teams facing off. Things are going to get frantic fast. Whatever team comes out of this with their hand raised is going to make a strong case for being the best in WWE. Headed to the top rope. On the top. Oh, man. Big time. Reversal. Can they go on the attack? Uh-oh. Oh, he's debilitating. Forearm strikes. Oh, that'll destroy your nose. Oh, no, no. Hold on a second. Could be a matter of time. Submission being locked in. This isn't going to win the ball, but it's going to do a lot of damage. A single head camel catch and a great job. Corey, what are the perils of this match that superstars must be concerned with? Well, this is the type of setting where you must be aware of outside interference because when it's no disqualification, it's not considered interference. It's legal. The match can change in an instant when another individual Here's a pick for the title. Oh, he counters right back on Hardy. Oh, oh, oh that's going to sting. Still in it. Super human. He's getting a huge boost right now from all those chants and cheers. Tough position to be caught in here.
kicked off. Got the one. This is a match with major stakes. He's been demanding this match for quite some time, and now he is ready to compete. And his opponent from New York, weighing in at 219 pounds, the superstar. We talk a lot about locker room dynamics. You'll never hear a single negative thing backstage about this superstar. Oh, that is what happens when you treat your fellow superstars with respect. They respect you right back. There are no awards for congeniality here in yeah, WWE. That respect means nothing if you lose. He said he'll be making a statement in this match tonight and will deliver it emphatically. Looking into the eyes of this competitor tonight, you know he understands the significance of this match. This is an opportunity to make big headway on the roster. Yeah, but he's staring at someone who's shown a lot of hustle to be in this spot. Whether he's studying tape or spending extra time at the PC, he expected this challenge and is ready for it. Good defense. Boom, running STO plants him. Nicely done. Shoulder. That's you, your noggin. Oh, this is pretty cocky. <laughs> you like that? Yep. Look at that insult to injury with that one. And he barely evades. Yeah. With the reversal. 
Left by the turnbuckles. Oh, that'll turn your skin red. He's on his heels a bit now. This is where endurance becomes so important in the late stages of the match. That was just malicious. Insulting. Trying to find his bearings, but it looks like his end is near. Here it comes. Oh, touches. Wow. Does he have a win in him now? Just one step ahead. A woman who reinvented herself with her return to NXT and found a compelling ally in Shotzi Blackheart, winning the women's tag team titles. Amber Moon always game, always ready, always focused. intense as I think it might be. Ember caught by surprise. Now she's allowing the WWE. Wow, wiping that smug look right off her face. Drop kick hits hard, lands harder. Re-entering the ring now. Nice amateur takedown, all the way over. Ooh. Ooh. Oh. Heads out of the ring, what's next? Russian leg sweep. The arm absorbing the damage. You know, usually I wouldn't suggest this, but in Ember Moon's case, I'll make an exception. Ember Moon's best bet is to go all out. Throw caution to the wind and just see where it takes her. It's worked so many times for Ember Moon before, and that means there's a chance it works here as well. Caught square by the Haymaker. Oh, man, just punishing. Smash. Ooh, treading all over their opponent. Just quickly into the cover with the title on the line. Uh, she's able to kick out before the refs count. She was hopeful going for the pin there. That's a bad landing. The champ taking their share of hits now. She still has a lot of time to recover, though. Catches a kick to the face. Very impressive array of strikes. And now she's looking to go top rope. Taking flight. Got the knees up just in time. This could turn things around. Oh, stop. Now a pin for the championship. 
Championship. One, two, no title still hangs in the balance. She just dug down deep there, but I don't know if she'll be able to do it again. is why they're the champ. This would be an amazing upset. Can she get her to... Perhaps thinking something else here. Not sure why, though, Michael. She seemed to have it really cinched in. Oh, man, a little extra luster behind that kick. Go for the run. The follow-away slam. The disciple has arrived. One of the most dynamic athletes in WWE, now under the learning tree of the Messiah. The Persian Lion. Here he comes.
This highly anticipated battle royal has begun. A very unpredictable kind of match. Chaos reigns supreme. Even the most seasoned superstar can fall victim to the numbers game or an unexpected elimination. The only possible strategy here is to be prepared for anything. Oh, knee to the brick basket. He was waiting for him to make his move. Oh, no, I think we're going to 
UFC. The electric chair. Nope. Only elbow right on the mark. And this might not have a pleasant ending. Right across the larynx. Strikers in all of WWE. It's a statement it's hard to argue with. We are looking at one of NXT's most successful competitors ever. A man who has achieved success yeah. all over the world and has the skills to add to his incredible resume here in WWE. No, get up. Come on, let's go. Amazing grappling and striking skills, supremely competent. O'Reilly's already backed it up and continues to do so. The brighter the lights, the harder the strikes for Kyle O'Reilly. Corey, what do you think of the champ's chances here tonight? I love them. I'm not like everybody else, Cole. It seems like everybody's ready to write the champ's demise, but not me. Introducing the challenger. From Vancouver, British Columbia, weighing in at 200 pounds, Kyle O'Reilly! And introducing the champion, from Seattle, Washington, weighing in at 180 pounds, he is the All-Star Eastern Wrestling Tri-State Champion, Harvey
The champion thrives in these situations. Pride and heart will be tested. Ladies and gentlemen, we could possibly see the title change hands and a new champion crown here. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Don't you think you're putting the cart before the horse, Cole? The champ is the champ for a reason. That hasn't suddenly changed. First DDT! End of the road. <laughs> Matt Slam with some attitude. There's some power behind that punch. Starting to set in. Hands of knee. Now this is the kind of match where you can really push the bounds of damage you can inflict. I'm not saying that a no disqualification match should mean from the top. Elbow drop. Good lord. And oh, look at the start of this. Could be going into the playbook for submission. Uh, he's in complete control. Opponent has nowhere to go. Nice escape. shocked as everyone else called his opponent included setting it up and I think we just might see the title change hands he kicks out somehow we knew it was not going to be an easy task to put the champion away, and that's being proven right now. More like the champions proving that sooner perish than lose their title. How draining was that? Can it be done again? Miles Taylor up. Ladies and gentlemen, as a reminder, the championship is on the line here tonight. And in looking at the opposition, I can say that the champion will have quite the hill to climb in this one. The challenge, confident look on his face. More than ready for...
As a reminder, the title is on the line here in this match. And the champ is certainly going to have an uphill battle. That's for sure. As far as title defenses go, this is about as big as it gets. He needs to be on his game tonight. Introducing the challenger from Tokyo, Japan, weighing in at 275 pounds, Ted Sawyer, Nate O. And introducing the champion from Houston, Texas, weighing in at 337 pounds. He is the International Wrestling Grand Prix United States Champion, Lance Arthur. The challenger not taking their eyes off the championship. And the champ is staring daggers right back at the opposition. the championship on the line, a champion on high alert. Ladies and gentlemen, we're in store for something special. Charring oh, European uppercut. Go oh, right to the kidneys. Golly. No, oh, that'll break his arm. Vicious. In search of some footing to make this huge climb. Trying to make their way out of the cage. Trying desperately to escape. Look out below. And he's thrown from the cage down to the mat. Yeah, he's going to have to try something else now. Ah, look at this. Jarring impact. Oh, Bulldog. One-handed. Stomping down. That kick will stop me you in your tracks. His arm vicious. Champ taking the worst end of the exchange. So much can happen in the confines of a steel cage. Byron, what is a sound strategy in this one? Focus on a body part like a leg. If damaged, your opponent will have difficulty standing, climbing over the cage, or even walking through the cage door. Wow, it sounds a bit cruel coming from you, Saxon, but I agree. Don't forget, you can win in the ring, too, and a damaged leg can lead to an easier pinfall or submission. Gotta wonder if the stamina is there to make it out of the way. The sprint up the cage is on. Oof. Takes incredible guts to make this climb. Back to the kidney! Oh no, he comes off the cage and lands right back in the ring. Sometimes Ooh. opportunities can backfire like that. Turning the tables there. Uh-oh. Look at this! Uh oh he's right. Carey's making his way up the cage. Fortitude being tested with every step. Trying to make their way out of the cage. Oh, no. Crash landing. And a hellacious fall from the cage. Oh, I did not like the look of that impact. Getting ever so close to the very peak of the steel cage. He's making Hayes climbing up the cage wall. And he's finally up to the top of the cage. He's nearly there. Just a few more sure-footed steps, and he's victorious. He doesn't want to spend too much time up there. He's working toward making his escape. He can almost taste the win in this cage match. Fought so hard to be in this position, but he's only halfway to victory. Oh, he almost had it. Inches away from victory. Yeah, he really thought he had it there. And as he continues to climb the side of the cage, you have to think his confidence is starting to build. The longer he's up there, the more fear starts to seep into the mind. Guys, I can't take this. The tension is off the charts. 
All the way from the top of the cage. Can they make the escape? Not safe up there. This blow will get him only. Oh, not so fast. Oh, man. Needs to be careful, though. Every movement is a dangerous one. Able to stop him here. Really showing his awareness. Battling on the top. Unceremoniously set right back down to the canvas. Yeah, he's going to have to try something else now. And he's just become merciless here. Yeah, the incredible. The title's in jeopardy here. I think the paradigm is shifted. Oh, he kicked out. What a display of stamina. The champ showing they are truly worthy of this title. But things might only get harder from here. And you can sense the desperation mounting as that last move couldn't finish things. The fight is being brought right to him. Yeah, and he keeps struggling to slow the opposition down. Now check this out. Oh, dropped in the back of the neck with the DDT. We got two champions. is a fatal four-way falls count anywhere match and is for the world championship introducing the challenger from new york weighing in at 192 pounds m j f here we go gentlemen Huge title match coming up. And a huge opportunity for the champ to prove to everyone that there truly is none better in all of WWE right now. And introducing the challenger from Panama City, Florida, weighing in at 179 pounds, Adam Cole! This is a big time opportunity, Byron, as the title will be on the line here. You're right, Michael, and judging from the response on social media heading into this match, we're likely to see a new champ crowned here tonight. Big matches are where this guy thrives, and competing for that title is about as big as it gets. And introducing the challenger, from Winnipeg, Manitoba, Canada, weighing in at 248 pounds, Chris Jerry O. Oh. Here we go, gentlemen. Huge title match coming up, and a huge opportunity for the champ to prove to everyone that there truly is none better in all of the... And introducing the champion from Cincinnati, Ohio, weighing in at 254 pounds. He is the world champion, John Max Lee. The champ comes into his title defense incredibly confident, Corey. And with good reason, Cole. When you're the champ, you don't have to worry about winning. You just have to make sure you don't lose. That is the champion's advantage. Looking at the champion, I guarantee there is no doubt in their mind as to who is leaving this match with the title around their waist.
This matchup is treacherous. Both competitors enter with no absence of malice. It's about inflicting the maximum of punishment. You have to create your own opportunity. Pinpoint body part and exploit it. Everything is at a competitor's disposal. The lack of rules makes a superstar even more dangerous. Oh, you can tell he's feeling it now. This fight is pumping him up. Superstar's imagination takes them. You won't miss any of the action. And you need a limitless imagination to win a match like this. You have to stay on the attack because fortunes can change with just one move. Yeah, especially in a situation where a limitless amount of real estate is your battleground. Dragon Sleeper locked in. Oh, no. Going for a pin for the championship. Gets the shoulder up after one. These men knew this match was going to be hard fought. Big forearm, but wait a minute. Oh, what a slap! Double underhook applied. Challenger eating up some damage. He turns it around. Knew what was coming there. Gets him with the counter. Oof. Here's the pin. Title on the line. And the champ does not end it. At this point in the match, that could have gone either way. And just like that, he sent crashing to the floor. Heads out, Nia, with the championship on the line! Are you kidding me? Right now, I just don't know what it's gonna take. He's taking this to the floor now. Trapping the arm. Cross face submission is in. The champ lies with blazed over. It's not embarrassing to tap out and save your career. His will to win is simply too strong. Look at this, he let it go. Curious decision there, Michael. Shoulders down. Championship on the line. And the count's broken, keeping the match alive. It's not over yet. <laughs> Slides back into the ring. Quick return to the ring. He's heading back to the ring. This one missed. Second one didn't. Oh, effective. The challenger eating up some damage. with punches. 
And not. Oh, now shoulders down. Can't believe it. Russian leg sweep. Oh, ran in there. Banging back with their own count. And he heads out of the ring. No count outs, no worries. Powerless position to be in right now. Here he comes, sliding back in. Back into the ring. He foiled that attempt. Send him up for the... Time, gentlemen. Oh, shot. The champ odds will glaze over. Two. Critical time in this matchup. This is a time to dig deep. The following contest is the Money in the Bank Ladder match. In this match, there are no pinfalls and no disqualifications. The first superstar to climb the ladder and retrieve the briefcase will be declared the winner, making his way to the ring from Chicago, Illinois, weighing in at 240 pounds, C.M. Now this is a superstar who can breathe new life into this crowd. They were already alive. Limitless. Wichita Falls, Texas, weighing in at 320 pounds, Keith Lee. Keith Lee is a different breed of human. Yeah, a walking mixture of size, speed, strength, and attitude. Immeasurable force. Once knocked the turnbuckles clean off the post. Now, you don't want to be in Keith Lee's path. This guy is ready for a fight. And from Gomez Palacio, Durango, Mexico, weighing in at 259 pounds, Andre Day. The WWE Universe already reaching a fever pitch upon their arrival, and we are just seconds away from a highly anticipated match.
from New York, weighing in at 234 pounds, Kenny Omega. You know, this person takes some pride in their work, but who could blame them? Few are as gifted in the ring as this performer. Wow, you are laying it on thick. from San Jose, California, weighing in at 318 pounds, Powell Holmes Holland. The great Maya Angelou once said, when someone shows you who they are, believe them the first time. First time that name's been cited in WWE, Corey. What do you mean by that? It means that this superstar's do. Here comes Cesaro. The Swiss cyborg has arrived. Hurry, we've said it before and we'll say it again. Pound for pound, Cesaro is the strongest man in all of WWE. And from Lucerne, Switzerland, weighing in at 232 pounds, the world champion, Cesaro. Gentlemen, I will never get tired of watching Cesaro do what he does. Every time he steps in the ring, you can expect a classic. Just look at the focus, the intensity, the drive on the face of Cesaro. Oh, yeah, I am pumped for this guy. And from Aberdeen, Washington, weighing in at 206 pounds, Brian Danielson. Let's just take a moment to talk about hypocrisy, Saxton. If the WWE Universe were on their feet for this particular superstar, you would be too. Corey, I don't always approve of this superstar's tactics, but I can't deny how willing they are to take big risks when the time is right. Wow, that was... And from Cleveland, Ohio, weighing in at 291 pounds, Warlord. Talk about an intense competitor. This superstar doesn't have an off switch. Nobody has an off switch, Saxton. Trust me, if you had one, I'd have hit it a long time ago. He is physically and mentally prepared for the task at hand in this big time match. First, but that's easier said than done. The key is to look for the opportunity to incapacitate your opponent and then get. Problem is, the ladder is not just a means to an end. It's a serious weapon in the hand of these competitors. Oh, no question, my man. Now we're going to lock in this submission. Oh, he fends off the attack. And imagine some physical violence. How does a superstar? the neck. What a chancery. 
Delivered into the barricade. Uh-oh, this is not going to end well. Oh, the back suplex coming through. Rake in the face. This is outright disrespectful. Oh, really? He's taking some good hits. Setting him up for the flat line. Man, face first. And the electricity of this moment is coursing through his veins. Tough position to be caught in here. Chest and now, and he stonewalls Cesaro there. Straight to the knee. Belly to belly suplex. That's one way to go. Ooh, that might have just broken something.
is surprising, Byron. Yeah, I'm not really sure why he would out right there. He's starting to struggle here. This has been an absolutely punishing Money in the Bank match. Ooh, right to the arm. What's he planning here? Strong European uppercut. What happened? 
action. Right in the mouth. Relentless. He's looking to get up that ladder, guys. A long way. One good pull, and he could have this match won. No, he's going to want to hurry up on that one good pull. Down. One good pull wins this thing. And now he's giving you all another chance to sit.
is ready to erupt. Are we close to the beginning of the end? 